my gosh, my jaw just hit the floor. This view through here. <gasps> oh my gosh. Welcome to Welcome to Jenica's home. Welcome to my crib. I got this for us this weekend, you guys. This is low key for us to hang out. Like what in the, like, okay, you guys, my jaw is just on the floor because I knew it was gonna be nice. But not like this nice. I think we heard Kendall and Kylie, Demi Lovato, have like rented this out in the past because what the heck? I stopped filming right as I walked in the front. I haven't even been in like a bedroom yet, but this place is unreal. Like never in all my life, in all the coolest places I've been, have I felt like this. Like, I, like honestly, photos and videos can't do it justice because I saw photos and videos where it came here, but then actually being here in person, I'm like, this place is magical. What the heck? Look at this. I gotta show you all the things. Okay, here's where you walk in. Okay, kitchen. It's really loud. Out front, I should probably go get my stuff. It's outside. Okay, there's gonna be everyone's gonna be up in here. Like, this was right when I stopped filming. When I started coming in this way because I saw that and I was like freaking out. But like, wow. Sorry, I'm gonna be so overwhelmed with everyone while we're here. <laughs> it's me again. Lauren! Guys, I'm so happy to see Gretchen again. I was just telling them, I'm like, this vlog is gonna be all over the place, especially so many people. And it's just, there's so much you wanna soak in that, like I almost don't wanna film because I'm like, this place is like magical. I know. <laughs> and I, know. Oh I like, feel like, like I know her. I know, that's I ran into her too, I was like, so, we go way back. So she like came around and I'm like, is that Jenica? So I heard her voice, I was like, no, it's Jenica. Oh, cutie. So but yeah, you guys, wow. it's like, Things like this just make me want to cry sometimes. I know. Like, That's why I feel like it's been such a long travel day. I'm like so disoriented yeah. and I'm like, here we are. And the last thing I think about though is like showing it on camera because I'm like, I there's know. so many people I haven't like seen. It in real life. Yeah. Yeah. Just try to keep up, okay? You're going to get little keep moments up. here and there. Yeah. She'll, she'll, so. Bridget always keeps you guys in the <laughs> You'll come along for the ride. She'll have a little text overlay. She does there it all. There you go. We'll figure it out. Yeah. Hey. Okay. Okay. No, it's literally amazing. Hey! Girl. I love like saying hi to the vlogs. Hey vlog! <laughs> you know what's my favorite is when I'm watching Gretchen's vlogs and she'll be like, she'll be like, I'm using my skin tint. My friend Audrey recommended it to me. And I'm like, ah, Oh, you give me credit. Me. No, oh, you always give me credit. Yeah. Oh, always give me credit. I love it. Hi, Annika. <laughs> I love it. This oh, is awesome. Sweating. Wow, I know, me too. I need yeah. to put on like, okay, not this. Yeah. I know. Like, oh, look at this out here. Oh, our dinner's definitely gonna be right here. It's gonna be so cute. Wow. No, I didn't know my jacket too. It's like, say you're, so you're in your house and this is your brother's room and that's your room and yeah. you share the bathroom. Yeah. Jill. Yeah, we have Jack and Jill. No. No, it's not really. It's just like what it's called, like the bath. Yeah, like I think if you share a bathroom, it's okay, Jack and Jill Yeah, there you go. Okay, Jack and Jill <laughs> Okay, they're in here. Yeah, yes. Look at our cute little bathroom. So nice. Nothing is little. I'm saying cute little. Like cute, so cute. So little. It's just so sweet and tiny. Like no. Like this like is <laughs> mad. She was just, like, it's literally an estate. Like I wouldn't even call this a house. Oh. Like there's like Instagram photo ops everywhere. Everywhere. Oh my god. I want my house to look like this. Me and Audrey are in here. Oh, we have like a little coffee bar. Coffee bar, you know, alcohol bar. <laughs> all the bars. All, all the bars. <laughs> you guys, we've been getting ready. Hey, always behind. Look at us in our colors. A We're queen so is never late. Everyone else is simply early. <laughs> it's from the princess bar. <laughs> it's so true. It's very us. Yeah. Like the party doesn't start to fly out there anyway. No, yeah, exactly. So, whatever. <laughs> I need to film every moment so of this pretty. because it's so beautiful here. No, it's literally stunning. <gasps> so pretty. I wish you guys could see how pretty this set is. It like looks so good. Here's two. Thanks, Rachel. I love our colors go together. They do. This is Revolve. In case anyone's, anyone's wondering, what I'm brand on Revolve, guys. Gretchen? I think Superdown. Love. We love an affordable sleigh. Shout out my friend Sydney. She was wearing it in orange in Puerto Rico and I loved it so much. And I saw they had this teal and I was like, 
think I need. My top tech trait is that if it's like one left in your size, I'm like, oh, well, I have to order it really quick because there's only one left. So it's always meant to be. I always do. So it always convinces me. You like no, you take it as a sign. You're like, mm -hmm. I'm like, oh yeah, it's meant to be. Okay, tell them about your set. Where is that from? This is Pat Bow. So it is a Pat Bow bikini. You can see it under there, and then like a, a skirt. It's a. Uh, Lace beach skirt is what it was so called, good. I think. Yeah, we love it. We love. It's so cool. Outfit of the night, behind the scenes. Work, yes. <laughs> mm, mm. This lighting is so good, we all need pictures in this spot. <laughs> you like glow. This is so Anna, she always loves pics like right in the direct sunlight. It looks so good. We all wanna be like mermaid Anna. <laughs> Look how cute. The dress is nice. flowers, the wind is Photo booth. We're a little bit freezing, but that's okay. <laughs> no worries. <laughs> We're gonna do our little photo booth session. Guys, look at our dresses. They're all different shades. Look how cute. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yeah, he's like, Chocker, me and Anna are things they ain't never. <laughs> we literally make everyone around. Never, Here. <laughs> look at this one. Beautiful. Little setup. Hello, everyone. Cute. The lights. Look how pretty you guys. Adderall. All the colors. So de Janeiro. All our favorite things. Guys, I keep getting up from dinner because this is so magical. And you just need like a whole shot. I feel like pictures and videos aren't capturing how nice this is. I have to show you guys. But I will say, I will say, I went home. I got this with you at Free People because you had it. Yeah, and I yeah. got it with Audrey. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> so it came from I circle. Mean, so many people, literally everyone I know. No, like, this is the best set. I wear it. I've worn this more than any other pajamas I've ever owned. I'm not kidding. It's so perfect. And then I wear the boots like with these by, the, by themselves and this, like I'll throw over anything. And it depends on the time. Sometimes there's like 15 colors. Yeah. There's a beautiful like bright, bright pink that I need. Mm-hmm. Oh, I'll see this. Yes. Oh, I'll show it on 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 I have to shower, been in my little cozy set. We were just like playing games and hanging. There is 15, 16 of us here, like such a big group. So it's been so fun meeting so many new people and just making friends, like literally the best vibes. Also while I have a moment to chat, like by myself, like I feel like we're not gonna have that much time, like you and me this long to like catch up because I'm just gonna be with people the whole time, like chatting, being in the moment, trying to like film little clips here and there. But like this place is, Unreal and I feel like I keep saying that like I was just like what I literally never been so much shock walking in here today And I just have to tell you guys like I feel like for months my manager was like hyping this up But I just was like, oh obviously it's gonna be amazing But I just felt like I've been to Coachella twice I've been to three pretty like amazing Palm Springs homes But like literally was I saying in the vlog earlier like celebrities have rented this place out and now I'm like I get it Like I walked in the front door and my jaw was like like you walk in and you see the most like expansive setting view like i just feel like i'm in hawaii like i don't know how else to explain it this place is like spectacular like i don't want to leave like everything is perfect i think i just want to move in here like you guys i don't think you understand like every little detail like i feel like i just notice all this, like oh everything's so good a little bathroom like look at these countertops like everything is just like insanely nice and I don't ever want to leave. Look at our cute little towels. There's like Le Labo candles everywhere, like showers, windows, like so bright, like so Asian arrows stuff everywhere. I literally can't. I'm just feeling like today I'm having one of those pinch me moments where I'm like, I am so blessed and like so grateful. And I hope you guys realize that. Like I just feel very, very privileged and lucky that I get to do what I do and that like I'm here and I don't know. And I just like get mad at myself that I ever complain. I'm like, oh, Coachella in the past, like I get so sick after you inhale so much dust. Uh -uh. Like it's like such an incredible opportunity and I am just feeling so lucky. And obviously like with anything in life, like any experience, I just, I'm being deep in my feels now, but it's always like the people that make it right. And just having like the best vibes, like the best group, like meeting so many new people 
it's just like so much fun i'm such an extrovert i'm like i'm like don't want to be overwhelming to girls but i literally meet someone and i'm like come here talk to me I'm like hey film me and tell me everything i'm like you're from here is your family still there i'm like you got any siblings so what's the deal with it I'm like wait go back to that <laughs> these poor girls are probably like i'm so scared of you but i'm like no like i'm just so curious like i'm like tell me everything fill me in it's the 411 and because i'm a pisces i'm like how are we doing anyway i need a shower <laughs> i'm just in my fields right now so I have to tell you guys, I'm so excited for the next couple days. I'll bring you along. Again, like I was saying with Lauren, try to keep up. Because <laughs> when the pace gets going quick, this is why we're having a slow chill moment right now. It's going to be crazy, but like I'll try to like document best I can. Oh, also can't bring one of these bad boys. See like the detachable lens. Like it's hard to show in the camera. I want you to see from the side. The M50. Like it's too big. So I can't bring that into Coachella. But I brought my smaller G7X that... You can't take off the lens because then the camera's without the detachable lens, you can bring it. So this vlog's gonna be so long, I already know. But yeah, showering and hopping into bed. Night, see you in the morning. I can't wait to see this place in the morning. It's gonna be like unreal. Oh, my lanta. Mm -hmm. Good morning. Good morning. Oh my god, you guys are like Charlie's angels. Good morning, Charlie. <laughs> okay, you have a wide lens, so it's like... I know, yeah, we can see all of you right now. Here we are. <laughs> oh, my toast. I thought you said toes oh, at first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like, my toes? <laughs> I'm like, did I just get him? <laughs> yeah, get him, get him going. Okay, avocado toast. Good morning. <laughs> Got some avocado toast. Okay, I showed you guys like a little section so moment of the breakfast. Probably all eaten up now but here look at this yeah. <gasps> actually i brought the coffee you guys. Okay. literally the last thing i showed was breakfast now we're on to lunch <laughs> i've just been doing content all morning but i had to show you look how good this looks oh i'm digging it that's right up my alley yeah this looks so good the girls are girling Hey, hair! <laughs> Already, you guys. Day one, here we go. Just gotta get some tape on here. I just had a whole discussion with the girls. I'm like, you know what? If you're a girl, you guys. <laughs> I think there's a happy medium of like, if your boobs are too big, they're in the way, but if they're too small, like an A, like me, all of your dresses and stuff like gape and they're just like empty. And I wish I had more boob to fill it out, but then the girls that have more boob, more boobs. <laughs> in the way i have to like tape them pull them out but you know so it's like what is a happy medium a b a c i don't know like double d now you're probably feeling like they're too big i don't know anyway what do you guys think wish these were like a little more filled out but i don't know if i'd ever pay for a pair maybe one day <laughs> anyway this is the fit for love and lemons from free people we love and it's my hair i think my camera died during they curled it did some braids and some texture spray did some of this hair oil the best you guys oh it's so good. Just like everything else full obviously smells delicious. So yes, I just gotta throw in my little cowboy boots. We're good to go. I'll like set this up outside so we can see the full ensemble. Okay, here's the full outfit. These boots are from Free People. I feel like I never ever wear this little mini Louis Vuitton backpack. This is like dedicated for Coachella now. I feel like I've had it every year since 2018. Full up. What's it called? Still sleepless. Woo! Audrey's the backseat DJ. <laughs> okay. Walking in. Everyone pray that the sun's still up so we can get some pics in our outfits in there. <laughs> if it's not meant to be, it's not meant to be. Oh, It'll be okay. So I know. We all got the cowboy boot memo. <laughs>
just the way we came in. <laughs> Ain't it crazy what love can do? Crazy what love can do. Grab me up in diamonds. Okay, <laughs> see you guys in an hour. When we make it home. <laughs> I don't know where what stage you guys have been at all night, but I've been at the Audrey stage. <laughs> Morning. I'm feeling unwell. <laughs> I'm so tired, you guys. Can you tell by my voice? Also, hindsight is 2020, but I wish I would have, like, you know, drank a little bit less since it was night one. Yesterday felt like a year long, and when it was like 3 a.m. when we got back and we're like chatting, whatever, and someone was like, You guys, that was only night one. I was like, The fact that we have two more days of this madness. I'm like, Also, I'll just be really real with you guys. Something so unfortunate happened. Like, long story short, pill I'm on. I, like, don't ever bleed, really. Sorry, we're just getting really, like, real quick. Yeah, like, ever. Unless I, like, miss a pill or, you know. But it'll be, like, once every six months for, like, a day or two, I bleed. Of course. While I'm here, I'm, like, walking into the festival yesterday. My see-through, like, white dress. I'm, like, you guys, like, I might just be, like, in my head. But, like, I think I'm bleeding. And no wonder, all day yesterday, I started to feel weird. And I'm, like, oh, my back and my stomach. I'm, like... This is very specific feeling and it feels like cramps and like what the heck and come to find out so many of the girls here are on their period and I'm like isn't that so weird like I think that's why because I haven't spilled nothing but like you know I, I don't know why this is like a fact but if you're a girl which like 90% of you are then you know what I'm talking about that like if you're around a bunch of friends after the period you get it too like why is that so I think that's why I started to bleed as I was walking in the festival I'm like oh my gosh and like for a while you're walking and there's like no porta potties or something and I'm like oh my god like running to a porta potty so thank god I just found a box of tampons around I'm like this is like the most unfortunate timing R.I.P. my dress but it's okay because you can see from like the front and the back I'm like you guys can you like tell of course lucky me oh also my cramps are so bad I'm like this is literally the most horrible timing I need to just like take a bunch of ibuprofen because I kept waking up in the night like every hour and I would just be like oh my stomach I swear, I don't know if any of you are like on the pillow one. I'm on low one, I'll just like tell you. And I love it, but since I don't ever bleed, like in my head, when I do, like every once in a while, once in a blue moon, my symptoms are extra bad. Like I feel like my symptoms just save up since like I don't have to make any sense and I feel like they're extra bad. I don't know if anyone really is what I'm talking about, but I'm just feeling like unwell. I need to just like shower, have a fresh start today. They got, um, why can't I think what they're called? Massage, uh, masseuse masseuses here uh that are giving massages i was about to say like massage art massage therapist maybe that's what they're called anyway there's massages here and i'm gonna get one soon and i'm so excited it's gonna feel so good like your body just i mean you guys know if you've been to any music festival your body just aches it feels like it's covered in bruises like you just feel beat up like being like pushed around in the crowd walking forever desert dehydrated like tired hot sweating like you know what i mean inhaling dirt like you just really your health just kind of takes a turn but i keep saying that like sorry i'm talking so long right now but this is my talking spot in the set it's mirror apparently in this vlog but like i just speak from coachella's in the past and that's why i'm like i need to stop being like i'm gonna be sick i'm gonna be tired like it's gonna be fine but i just remember how yeah like if you know you know it's just same old stuff so i'm like i need to like drink a lot of water take care of myself check my pee string that I got up at 7 yesterday and I'm like I must sleep in later the other days because getting up at 7 and then staying up to like 3 like I can't or like I need to like nap in there you know so I just wanted to see Kelly Harris live I'm freaking out <laughs> I'm so excited I want to cry I'm gonna cry wait <laughs> sing for my vlog again sing us more Calvin Harris okay, well, okay. when I met you in the summer <laughs> <laughs> Look how good lunch looks. We got chicken salad, croissant sandwiches, and quinoa salad. Tomato this. Fit check. I'm about to be late. I'm about to get yelled at. So, this is uh, for Love and Lemon's bathing suit and cover up. I think it's so cute. Little cowboy boots. Same little backpack. Just got my hair done. 
feeling a little naked, but that, oh, the lighting's better this way. This is the final look. <laughs> Then we'll be on our way. We're also colorful. I know, I love it. Made it. How cute. Guys, the music's so loud, I can feel it in my bones. The cute. Cute. Guys, we're trying to find a good picture spot. And we're like in front of here. It's kind of hard. It's very harsh lighting. It's also like a thousand degrees. <laughs> A lot darker yesterday when we got here, so I have to oh, like show my phone. Oh yay! The one you're just singing, Nick. Oh yeah. Oh yay! Okay, we're walking over to Sophie Tucker right now, just in time. They're just starting. We're so excited. I'm so happy because outdoor stage is right there, and I thought it was way farther from the main stage, which is right there, but it's pretty close. So don't have too much walking because yesterday Sahara is like on the other side, all the way over there. It took us like. 30 minutes to walk over there for two friends and Metro Boomin. It's just pure exhaustion. <laughs> and Revolve Fest was fun. Like, I will not be doing that again today because I know that's just what took so much out of me because it was like peak sun in the middle of the day beating down. Like, it was so, yeah, I know that just drained me. And then trying to stay out that late. Did I even say, no, I was definitely not taking content. And the hardest part is like during Calvin Harris, we are like, okay, hey, it's gonna be so crazy. Trying to leave at the end. Let's go after a couple songs. Leave at 1230. We did not get back here until 230. We're two miles away. Getting out of the parking lot takes an hour and a half. Everyone's leaving at the same time. Like it is just so I went to bed probably at like four almost. <laughs> I can't believe we still have day three. I got a shower, I'll feel a lot better. Look at the leftover of my hair. Like this is not good. This is very, very bad. But it's all gonna get better. We're gonna rally. Here we go. These are gonna bring me back to life. Look how good this looks. I'm so excited. I have to tell my vlog about the eight foot tall man. Like he was legitimately over seven feet. He had to be. This looks like we're pretty similar in height. We're tall. Like the sweat was just like. We were like his shoulder height. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, so if you could tell my clips at Odessa, the really, really sick one that like looks like it's from way high up and you can see the whole crowd behind us, it's because this man, this massive man, like this one shot of us, was behind us and he was so nice. It was actually very hard to get to the front to meet our friends and he like let us through and then he saw me filming and grabbed my phone and like picked it up like this and like spun it around and it was so cool. That's how you could see me in it and we were like, wow, thank you, sir. <laughs> swim and now I'm all showered and clean. It was so nice to be in the sun because I feel like every day so far I'm like I want to lay in the sun and then I like actually did. 
did. So after sun, a little routine. We're gonna go in with the Boom Boom Cream. You guys know this is like the original. I really love the pink, like the Beha floor. I just posted a TikTok where I was spraying the Beha floor perfume mist all over and using the Elastic Cream as well. But I'm gonna go in with the original since I love using it with body oil since it's like the same scent, Boom Boom Body Oil. So thick and creamy and moisturizing. We've lived so much life together. I've used this for years. I've probably gone through like 100 bottles and it just smells so good. There's nothing quite like it. So moisturizing, also like firming and just like smoothing, I feel, and the best thing after the sun because my skin is so dry and crispy right now it's gonna be so good especially since like i have a lot of skin chilling for i can't believe it's day three already of coachella so it'll be so good to be like all moisturized glowy first okay now the body oil this is like my newest obsession it's living under a rock i know it's like a newer product but i don't know what took me so long to get on this because it's so so good look at that smells like heaven. I've been loving the pairing it with body cream, but I'm just gonna put this all over. I'll have these linked down below. I know I have a section on my Amazon storefront and now with like body care items, it's like literally all their stuff because all their stuff is my favorite. So I'll have that linked in the description. Obviously I didn't even show you guys, but look how stocked up we are in the shower. This has quickly become my most favorite shampoo and conditioner. Just smells so good. Like they all smell like sunshine. I don't know how to describe. What would you say they smell like, Audrey? The, boom, um, the shampoo, the shampoo, the body wash. Yeah, and the body wash. Like they all have well, that it's yummy all, smell. It's all the boom boom scent, right? Yeah. Well, it's like. It's sunshine. <laughs> well, yeah. Think like tropical, nutty sunshine. Yeah. Is the way I would. And like it. sweet and yummy. Like you kind of want to eat it. <laughs> oh, if if there was like a imagine, ice cream like, flavor. You know, oh, no, no, no. Um, you know, the do you have like tasty cakes? Do you know like a crimpet? No. You don't know what a crimpet is? <laughs> okay, crimpets are like these, they're like, so tasty cakes are like a Philly thing. Okay. And crimpets are a type of tasty cake. Okay. If you had a tasty cake, like with the Sol de Janeiro <laughs> lotion. Boom Boom lotion, but like in a taste, like a taste. <laughs> yeah, like a frosting, I could see that. Insane. Yeah, it would be so good. I mean, no. Yeah. Wait, they should actually expand into food. <laughs> Please make this into a frosting and we will be eating it by the handful. <laughs> if I see if I see that they make this if they make this a thing, I I have steak in this. Okay. You, started you are I five percent to me. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, like, that's how good it smells. You know, I mean, everyone knows. Like, I feel like it's so popular, but yes. And we also have been getting into the body scrub, which is so nice, especially for the sun or the sun, all the things. I feel like it's like just like really, you know, exfoliating and the body wash. So good. So, I just show you guys that too. I'm all boom, boom, cream out. Like, I literally smell exactly like it, like every inch of me, and I'm loving every second of it. Finally ready. I'm feeling very. They did some gems in my hair, some little barrettes, and I just curled the ends real quick. My bralette is from Free People, so cute, right? And then this skirt is Revolve, and luckily I have this like nude little undie high-waisted type thing under that I could put underneath. Same cowboy boots from Free People. I wanna say they're Jeffrey Campbell. Same little backpack bag that I've had this whole time. Okay, show us the TikTok. Jesus. Queen! <laughs> Look at this outfit. This is like the perfect hour of lighting for photos. We're taking a bunch of photos. There's a lot happening. Look at Anna's outfit. Everyone's looking so slay. There's a million people and it's like soft light. <laughs> also, may or may not have lost my wallet. That is a okay. It's all good. I got the yummiest noodles, you guys. They look kind of scary, but they're like spicy garlic stir fry noodles. The veggies and stuff, they're so good. You're gonna love them. Are they good? Yes. The spiders I've had the past two days. It's hot. They're so good. There's like onions and mm, mm, mm. 
and like on like a Hawaiian roll. Yeah, <laughs> so good. Packing up to head out to the airport. Audrey's flight was earlier. She already left this morning and so sad. I don't want to go. This went by so quick. After day one, we were like, oh my god, we have two more days of this. Like, I don't know how we can do it. And now I'm like, I don't want to go. It went by so quick. We stayed in the most magical place and I showed you guys. Did I show you enough of it? Maybe I'll give you one last overview. I feel like so lucky, so blessed. And I don't think I said this on the blog. The first day I was so emotional. I literally sat in Jenica's room and cried for like two hours, you guys. I don't know what came, well, I do know what came over me. I'll tell you. But I was sitting there like, just posting stories from the first night and I was just like so emotional and I heard like the girls singing to Taylor Swift outside and there was a breeze and I could hear the water and I was just like I am so lucky like I'm gonna cry thinking about it again because I was just like I feel so grateful I feel like not even like deserving like and I literally was just crying because I'm like I want like everyone to be able to experience this like I just feel so lucky that my job like gives me opportunities like this and I was just like I want everyone like all of you watching to be able to like be here with me I just feel like I can't even like put it into words you know but I literally for like two hours I started to like uncontrollably sob and like Anna came in and you know when you see someone you love and that you're close with and Anna walked in and was like is everything okay so I start crying again like you know that feeling and her and Jenica were like what is wrong and I was like just so grateful like we are so lucky and then I really started crying I was thinking I'm like think about 10 year old you and like getting to tell like 10 year old version of myself that we get to do so like this I'm gonna cry again but like I don't know why <laughs> I just feel very lucky and I feel so grateful for the best management ever shout out table rock management day of like gone above and beyond literally all us girls were like we felt like royalty <laughs> this weekend like there's already staff running around like chefs like I'm literally being wait waited on hand and foot and I'm like can everyone like sit down and like put their feet up I'm like I'm gonna take care of you like this is too much so I just felt like I can't even put how grateful I am like into words so that's that but <laughs> what I was gonna say is the first day when I was like I'm like I can tell like I'm uncontrollably like emotional I'm like I must and like I don't I would think I told you or maybe I did say the first day because I think I was saying my whole period situation <laughs> how um, I don't bleed on my pillow low, low but if I'm around a bunch of girls that I say that like once in a blue moon I get it and then I realize like everyone here is on their period so I think that's why I started bleeding but I knew I was like like a day where I like can't stop crying like everything makes me cry I'm like I'm about to get my period so that was like a part of it too but I really do feel that but I'm like okay I feel like emotional and grateful and would usually have like a little cry but I'm like why can I not stop crying <laughs> you know oh, the joys of being a woman I'm like I my emotions are not in control right now I'm feeling out of control looking up the most like gorgeous gorgeous room one little last overview we had to get going it's gonna take us like four hours to get to LAX the Monday after Coachella is always craziness beautiful flowers I was walking around over here this morning I don't think I did like the best job even showing you guys the whole estate the whole property here like the two pools golf course but what I didn't even really do because this pool is way hotter than that one so yesterday I was just swimming in that one you guys saw because I think this one heated and the other one I don't know but there's like a full swim up bar over here like this place just never ends it's kind of crazy all these little secret spots but and I didn't even show you like the whole main house I gotta like get back in like I said but I just wanted to end off this vlog showing my immense gratitude for literally things that I wouldn't have been able to do without you guys like this is all because of you guys and your support supporting my channel for like 11 years and yeah I'm just feeling overwhelmed with gratitude there's this here I'll go inside one last overview Everyone's packing it up. Like the rooms just keep going. Back this way, this way. This was like when we first came in day one. We would keep getting our hair done in here. Another bedroom. This is like my favorite little spot. I think it's so cute, but okay. Packing it up. Say bye vlog. Bye vlog. <laughs> Thanks for coming. See Thanks for everything this weekend. Oh my god, same time, same place next year. Can't wait. <laughs>